Now to the tropical update we go. The new advisory is in on tropical storm Fiona. Not a lot of change with the strength. Winds of 60 miles per hour moving west at 15 miles per hour. This should be moving across the Leeward Islands come tomorrow evening. And then Saturday into Sunday, we'll be tracking it as it moves right about the Virgin Islands and Puerto Rico. And then on Monday, check out what we're seeing with our forecast track on Monday evening. It's in the vicinity of the Dominican Republic and Haiti. Does it have a lot of interaction with land or will it have uh, more so a journey that keeps it over the waters? And that's going to help determine how strong of a system it will be at that point. But notice the official intensity forecast from the National Hurricane Center, keeping it a tropical storm with 65 miles per hour winds as we go through the weekends. But whether it is going to be going more northward, a stronger system would favor a more northward track, or if it's a weaker system, it could stay more westward. And that's going to be important in terms of where we start to see its placement when it's about ready to make that turn up toward the north, because that's going to give us more information about where it will be in relation to South Florida and the Bahamas. What will it mean for South Florida and the Bahamas? Right now, it's too soon to pinpoint that. But we do need to keep an eye on Fiona and you at home. Make sure you're checking in with us to see what's going on with this tropical storm.